Hello students and welcome to Short of Source classes. This is real analysis. If you have any doubt or query, you can call or WhatsApp us at 9367-93076 or and if you want to check out more cool content, head over to our website at www.shortofstarclasses.com. So let's get started. This topic for today is bounded sets. So what is a bounded set? Okay, so let's come to the very definition of bounded sets. Uh, set bounded above set bounded above so what we write is the definition let s be a subset of r that is a set of real numbers we say we say that s is bounded above is bounded above if there exists a real number b in fact let me write this as b belongs to r not necessarily a member of S, B not necessarily a member of S such that such that X belongs to S and this implies x less than equal to b for all x belongs to s so the number b is called the number b is called the upper bound right so every member of the set s should be less than a number which is real and b this number b is not necessarily a member of the set s so let's say we have the set uh, 1 uh, 2 3 dot 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 in fact let me write the set of natural numbers x such that x belongs to n and um, x is less than 10 or equal to 10. So an upper bound may be 11 or 12 or 13 whatever. This is the upper bound. 12, 13 or 11 is not necessarily a member of the set S. This is S. Yet it's called the upper bound. So similarly, we'll define a set bounded below, which is set bounded below. So this is let S be a subset of R. We say S is bounded below if there exists a number b belonging to the set of reals not necessarily necessarily a member of s such that, such that, let's pull this up, yeah, such that x belongs to s implies x is in fact, it is right, b is less than equal to x for all x belonging to s. 
so the number the number b is called the lower bound of s of s so similarly if we have a set uh, s equals to x as of x to the set of natural numbers x less than equal to 10 then we have the bounds that minus 1 can be a bound minus 999 can be also a lower bound minus uh, let's say uh, minus 10 billion can be a lower bound it doesn't matter how large it is but it is a lower bound it is a lower bound since every element of the set s is greater than minus 999 or minus 1 or minus 9 billion so this is called a lower bound and we have an unbounded set let me just give you an example of an unbounded set unbounded set so a set s is said to be unbounded unbounded B is a subset of R, subset S being a subset of R. Let me just write that down properly. Uh, a set S, subset of R, is uh, said to be unbounded if there does not exist. Uh, number there does not exist not numbers numbers big B and small b such that x belongs to s implies b x b so as you can see this b is the upper bound and b is the lower bound and there does not exist numbers b and b such that this definition holds so we have uh, let me give you an example of an unbounded set let's say the set r no matter what number we choose no matter what number we choose the set r is never bounded because no matter how large the number is or how small the number is we still cannot find a number small enough so that it lies outside the set of R or inside the set of R such that every element of the set R is either less than the that number or is greater than that number we cannot find a number B small b such that uh, it is uh, every element of R is greater than B small b and we cannot find a number capital B which for all elements of the set R it is less than that number say suppose you want to take 10 to the power uh, let's suppose uh, give me a huge number so let's suppose this number this number still belongs to the set R and you may say that we write R as uh, this is R minus infinity to 2 minus infinity these are the lower bounds but this is not true because the infinity and minus infinity are belonging to an extended set of the real numbers so it is not a subset of the reals and hence these are not true bounds of the set of R, right? So, thank you for watching this video. We'll be back with more interesting concepts in the next video.